which scatter plot shows a negative association that is not linear. Helpfully in this question, they then go on to define for us what a negative association is. A negative association between two variables is one in which higher values of one variable correspond to lower values of the other variable and vice versa. In other words, as one variable increases, the other is going to decrease. And as one, the other variable increases, the other variable is going to decrease, right? They go in opposite directions. So what we should expect then, if we we're just kind of sketching out our own graph, is as our x-coordinate increases, right, as we go to the right, this y-coordinate should decrease, right? That's what a negative association means. So we should get something sloped or curved downwards like that. So right away we can get rid of C because it's like a U-shape. And we can get rid of D because D's got no relationship. One of the things you might try to do as well is create the best fit line or the best fit curve. Right? And we did this in a previous episode where we want to draw a line that tries to go through as many of the points as possible. This is not a negative association. In fact, there's no positive or negative association overall. It's just kind of a U-shaped curve. And here, if we try to draw a best fit line, I guess we can do something like this. It's just not clear that there's really any relationship between the data at all. Certainly, it's not increasing as the other decreases. There's no negative association here, so we can get rid of D. Notice A... You can get like a curve like that, and B would look something like that. So they're both negative associations, but which one do we want? We want one that's not linear. So we do not want this line. We want the one that's curved, which is choice B. So a couple things on this one. Number one, be very careful to read the question carefully, right? That it's not linear, and that's a negative association. And then draw in your own best fit lines to help you see how the data is moving. And in this case, it leads us to choice B. To learn more about Reason Prep's SAT, SAT Subject Test, and ACT video courses, go to reasonprep.com enroll, and you can find the link in the description below the video.